What is going on guys? This is Rampage Rico and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to get the Skull Crusher bow. So we have actually the the wolf bow. The salet or whatever you wanna call it. And we're gonna actually get the the skull crusher bow. Okay, so the first step you need to do is to shoot an arrow right to the symbol right over there. And it's gonna open this and drop an arrow. That is gonna be the first step, or a broken arrow. So we're gonna go ahead and pick out this broken arrow and we're gonna work on the next step. Ooh, baby, baby, baby. Whoops, 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 whoops. I want too many zombies. I don't know why I have all these zombies. And this one is actually one of the more spookier bows to get done. So the next step is to melee kill a zombie right in this area of the circle. Um, kind of circle thing. I'd say it's going to be a square. And, um, and it's going to open up the ground out of this circle. This is actually really, really spooky one. So you got to get the zombie right in this area. It helps to get to have like a, a, a melee weapon. I mean, a Bowie knife. Because a Bowie knife, actually, you kill him and you'll just die right here. So that's going to be very, very useful. Come on, zombie. Who's going to be the lucky one to get here first? All right, and it's going to open up the ground. Let's see. Just did that. Awesome. All right, we're going to go ahead and press square and it's gonna push this all the way up and now we're ready for the next step so the next step is to get these skulls that are going to be all around the map so one of the locations is going to be right over here this is the skull bam we got it another look that was the first one and the second one is going to be right over here bam um Alright, so another one is going to be in Samantha's toad box right over there. Boom. Another one is going to be right over here, close to the computer computer area, or computer room. Another one is right by the teleporter in this sink over here is going to have the other one. So now we're going to go ahead and teleport. Alright, so now we teleported. And uh, the last skull is going to be down here in this uh, location behind this truck right over here. Right over there. There you go. And that is the last one. So we picked out all these skulls. Now we're going to go ahead and teleport back. I don't know if the teleporter needs to pull down. Okay, for the next step now that we have all these six skulls here. So what he wants us to do is to get some crawlers, and the crawlers are going to be eaten by these skulls. So each crook skull that eats a crawler, they eat it by one at a time, is going to disappear. And once you get all six disappeared, he's going to give us the next uh, the next challenge. Alright, so now that we have about six crawlers, we're gonna go ahead and bring them over here and they're gonna be sacrificed for bastards. <laughs> so let's bring these four crawlers in here. And uh, this is really, really cool. Check it out. They're gonna have eat. Each of the skulls are gonna have only one crawler. There's just. And the skulls disappear as they go. I had more uh, crawlers. Yeah, I do. I have more crawlers. All right, we have one for each skull. So you need six crawlers to be sacrificed over here, and they got three more coming over. You keeping these two zombies so we can go and work on the next step. My little crawler. Come on, buddy. You guys are really taking your time. This is really cool stuff. The crawler is just 
munching on the zombie. Really cool. And the souls are going in there, which is really, really, totally dope. Got two more to go. Boom. Now you need to pay attention to what he's going to say. Alright, so you said. So you said door. Uh, horn and griffin. So now. We need to memorize the symbols that whenever we hit those. Show up. So, uh. So we're going to go to. The knights. And we're going to hit them in a specific sequence. We're going to press X in a certain sequence. So first of one of them was the door. So that symbol we need to shoot with the arrow. And then it's going to be the horn, which is this symbol. We're going to have to shoot next. And then the griffin, which is this, is that. Okay, so now that we know all the symbols, let's go ahead and put them in sequence. Actually, um, I did this too early. We need to kill souls until we get the... Yeah, my bad. Alright, so uh, once you remember those... You need to kill zombies until they give you the symbols. And once they give you those symbols, then once you acquired all the symbols, you go ahead and do that step. We need all the symbols to show up down here. And once we have all the symbols down here, we can go ahead and do the next step. So now once all these symbols, we have to retrieve them from the zombies. And once we do that, then we can go ahead and do the next step. Oh, we got one. Alright, cool. As you see, it's showing up over there. Awesomeness. You don't have to do this in here. Uh, I actually recommend not doing this in here. Because it is the Let's go another symbol. Oh, I don't want this. Death machine is going to be my death. Nope. Ooh. I got another symbol. Nice. Ooh, another symbol. Ooh, nice. We got another one. I think we're only missing one. Awesome. We got them all, I think. Right? Yes, we totally got them all. Sweet. So now... So we, kill a bunch of zombies. we can go ahead and do the next step. Okay, so now we have all the symbols in the proper spots. Now we can go ahead and uh, find out what's the sequence for them. Actually, I, I'm not sure if we doing that earlier, if that counted or not. So we're going to go ahead and try it. Uh, maybe you can do that right away, but then you're going to have to do, get the symbols to do it. So there, right, so first one was this one. Okay, we did it right. And then the second one was this one. And then the third one was this one. So we did it all. So that's, when you do it right, he says, that is my name, and boom. Cool. So that is done. So now, I have to interact with that until it's actually all gone and then once that is all done with we can retrieve the arrow like I just did we should have looked at it a little bit more it's really cool looking and go to the last step I'm the right one I think there we go there we go there we go and now we kill zombies over here sacrifice the zombies over here okay I did it right Sweet. I have no ammo. I feel this will prove valuable weapon That's for great. journey. Oh, perfect. Insta kill. That's what we need. You want dance? Check it out! 
super awesomeness. Yeah. This one is really cool. It gets skulls to come and eat the zombies. It is very, very dope. If you shoot it all the way back, it makes this cool portal kind of looking thing, and it brings the skulls to eat the zombies, which is so insanely dope, might I add. Uh, this one is one of the most coolest ones. It has really, really cool features. Because especially the skulls that come and eat the zombies, that is super dope. So that's going to end it for this video. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. This was really, really fun.